Some good news tonight for people who live in the Nakia Creek Fire Evacuation Zone. People who were forced to leave their property are now going back home. Fox 12 So Young Kim joins us now live from downtown Canvas after speaking with some people who helped those who left. So Young. Clark Regional Emergency Services sent out a message today to people living in areas impacted by the Nakia Creek fire saying all evacuation orders have been lifted. People we spoke with say it's a big relief. But it's been a crazy week. Thick smoke and flames close by made for a scary few days for people who live near Camas. It is mostly fear of the unknown. People we spoke with say this is the first time they've experienced being in a wildfire evacuation zone. What do I need to bring with me? Where am I going to stay tomorrow? You know, do I need to be, you know, I need to leave like right now? I don't know. It's kind of, kind of freaky. We actually did make um, arrangements to to go to another place if we had to. The fire started on October 9th. This week, thousands of homes were evacuated and tens of thousands more were on standby notice. Now officials say all evacuation orders have been lifted and people say they're grateful. Go firefighters. <laughs> I appreciate it. We caught up with volunteers and staff at Camas Church of the Nazarene, which served as the Red Cross evacuation site all week. They say they were overwhelmed by the outpouring of love from the community. It was awesome. There's a steady stream of people dropping off stuff. And are glad to have been able to play a part in providing for their neighbors in a great time of need. The easiest part was just opening the doors. The Red Cross did the lion's share of the work and their volunteers and their staff were over the top. For Margaret, a potential evacuation isn't the only first she says she's experiencing. I've never thought I'd say this, but I'm really happy that rain's coming. <laughs> Officials say the fire is still active and 23% contained. Investigators are still looking for several people who may be involved and are asking anyone with information to contact the Clark County Fire Marshal's office. Live in Camas, So Young Kim, Fox 12, Oregon.